Welcome to Your Sports Swindon. I'm here with Nathan Cleverly today. How are you doing, Nathan? Yes, I'm good, mate. Thank you very much. Excellent. So we're down at Paddy Fitzpatrick's gym today, and you've been doing some sparring with Luke Watkins mm. and Sam Sniper Smith. Yeah. How was that? Yeah, it was good. It's, I love coming down to Swindon. You know, it's a cracking gym. It's a great atmosphere. We walk in, the Bob Marley music is going. <laughs> I can smell a bit of Jamaican food. So it's uh, it's just a great atmosphere. Paddy, you know, he's a great guy, and he's got some uh, he's got some good guys in the gym, like you said, Luke. Luke Watkins, Sam Smith, um, they've just in, well they've had a few pro professional fights each but it's good sparring, you know, I've uh, just done a mix the rounds with those guys and uh, it's good, good work, yeah, good solid I mean, work. Let's talk about, you know, Luke first and foremost, um, crew, cruiserweight so he's, he's probably got a stone on you, is he, yeah. is he exactly the kind of person you need to be sparring and readiness for your, you know, your w mm. WBC international? Yeah, it's good. It's, it's good to mix up you know, a few heavy guys, a few lighter guys. Like Luke is, is a cru cruiserweight. He's solid, and you can feel it. You know, even when they're jabbing, you feel solid, strong, strong guys. Um, a bit of weight behind them. So that's good to get used to the strength. Uh, you can't. You know, just you've got to go some to push push those guys around. Um, and the you know you can get the lighter guys in there for a, for a bit of movement, a bit of speed. So it's um. It's a good mix, you know, like Sam's like heavy, Luke Cruiserweight, and it's a, it's a good mix, and both, yeah. both good guys, and they're both well-schooled, because yeah. Pad, that's the one thing with Paddy's guys, they're well-schooled, do everything correctly, nice solid job, good technique, so it's, a, it's good work. Yeah. How do you think they both did in there against you, because, you know, you're on a different level today yeah. at the moment, so yeah. you know, it's a great opportunity for them. Yeah, well, I, I stayed in for the full, full 12 at uh, Sam. Uh, no, Luke came in first for six, then Sam jumped in for six, and uh, yeah, they, they're good. You know, Luke is nice and solid, does it, does everything correctly, um, throws his punches correctly, good technique, um, and he throws most of his shots. You know, he, he doesn't pebble with his shots. Mostly, all of his shots are nice, nice solid punches. And Sam then was was just turned professional, nice tight guard, um, and again. Nice boxer on the, on the, on the, on the back foot. Jab move, jab move, bringing the right hand. So uh, he's a neat, neat and tidy boxer. Yeah, and Paddy was obviously in the corner watching everything going on. He had a little word with you at the end. A little bit of advice there that you can share. Yeah, I, lo I, lo I love having a bit of advice of Paddy because you know it's, it's top class advice. You know he's been he's been in boxing for for many many years and you can you can learn a lot and uh, he always has his input and you know I. I'm grateful for that because uh, you know sometimes you don't see it yourself, and he's got a good eye. And he just said a little word, and uh, you know he says you can see the improvement uh, from last time I came down. It's quite a while back. Um, a little bit more patient, and uh, it, um, it went well. Excellent. Your training camp, I suppose, is coming to an end now. Uh, mm. Confident ahead of the fight? Yeah, confident. I've left no stone unturned. For this fight, you know, I've trained well. I'll get, I think I'll get answers in this fight. Um, as you know, I went up the cruiserweight, which was a bit of a rust decision. You know, I put on a lot of weight in the space of one year. Went up the cruiserweight um, for the big fight with my rival Bellew, and um, you know, it was a calculated gamble. But I'm back down to light heavyweight now, back to where I belong, my true weight. I make the weight fine, I made fine for my last fight. Um, so we, we're back now, but like I said, I'll get answers in this fight. And the answers are, have, uh, am I, have I still got the fire? Have I still got the fire? Um, maybe if there's a few naysayers who say I, I've lost the fire. Um, have I got that back? And uh, in training I feel as though I've got it back, but you soon know on fight night that's where you know, if 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 the fires, if the fires there, um, if you still got that spark, um, and I feel I've got it, and this is a this is a proper fight. From far, he's a he's a good strong guy. I'm up against it. He's the favourite in the in the bedding, but I'm loving that. I'm gonna go over there and I'm gonna I'm gonna shock uh, the light heavyweight division. Yeah. I mean, it'd be fantastic if you do. Have you got to get a knockout out there? Uh, it's it's going to be tough in Chicago. He's a Polish fighter based in Chicago. There's a there's a um, 
a big Polish base out there, so I'm, I'm kind of in his home territory. It's going to be difficult, but I'm up for it. I'm, I'm up for this fight. Have I got to get the knockout? I'd like to think I wouldn't have to get the knockout to get the, the victory. I'd like to think that the scoring would be fair. I'm the, I made the best man win, and I believe I can be the best man. Let's, let's just go out and, and prove it now. That's great. Well, we look forward to seeing that, and we wish you all the very best. Thank you very much. Thank you for joining us. Thank, Thank you, mate. Cheers. Cheers.